What's up guys, this episode we're gonna be building the OmniAuth client for our doorkeeper OAuth provider that we built in the last episode. So that was just the stuff to set up the OAuth process to be handled server side and our main application is the provider. So now we're gonna be consuming that API and we're gonna be using OmniAuth to do that. So this is gonna be pretty fun um, and we're gonna build our own Ruby gem for this. So luckily, uh, Doorkeeper gives you a strategy on their wiki that you can copy and paste. This is going to get you pretty much everything you're going to need. You're just gonna change a, the URLs and a couple other things potentially if you need to. So what this does is defines our doorkeeper class as a strategy and we'll be able to change the name of that um, as you can see here the option name doorkeeper we can change that to whatever your application's name is so this would be like stripe or twitter or facebook all lowercase and underscored um, as the name so let's go and say bundle gem omnioth hyphen door kept our application is called door kept um, which is going to be the name of our gem. So we'll go in there and we'll open up our code base. So your gem will come with uh, basically this file right here that we will use to define our doorkeeper strategy. So what we're gonna do is paste this in. We're also going to want to go to our gem spec and open that up. So let's open up the gem spec. And of course, you're going to need to change your summaries and your descriptions to get rid of those to-dos and fill all this out. However, the most important thing here is we wanna go down here and say spec add dependency. 